A couple charged with animal cruelty is insisting that they are both innocent. Now, they spoke with us today for the very first time since this bizarre story unfolded more than a week ago. Now, you may remember wallabies, a monkey, and other exotic animals found in a Mottville Township home. WSBT 22's Zach Crenshaw is at the live desk right now. And, Zach, you talk to them face-to-face. -face. At the courthouse in Centerville, Rick, Jessica Ackberger and Troy Levy are both charged with animal cruelty of 10 or more animals and killing or torturing of animals. But they told me today they believe they will be proven innocent. It's a sight you don't quickly forget. An albino wallaby standing in the door of a rural Michigan home. Jessica Ackberger lived there and was arrested after police were tipped off about poor living conditions for more than 20 exotic animals, including a monkey. Inside Centerville, Michigan's St. Joseph County Courthouse today, Ackberger and Troy Levy emerged from a small meeting room with their attorney, trying to avoid our cameras and not wanting to answer my questions. What would you guys talk about today? No comment. Is there any... Part of that do you not understand? No comment. I mean, I still have the right to ask questions. I got to do my job. I have the right to refuse them, uh, and I'm not... I understand that. So stop. Look, Thank you. Is there any credence to the uh, charges of animal cruelty? I mean, is there anything you want to say to people? Earlier in the courthouse lobby, before their lawyer arrived and off camera, Ackberger and Levy answered some of my questions. Jessica Ackberger said the animals were, quote, well taken care of. Troy Levy told me the cruelty, none of that is true. We expect to get all of the animals back. As we reported, the two were associated with Down Under Reef Pet Shop, which used to be in Granger and is now in Elkhart. They said that relationship ended, though, in 2014. Levy said he did not leave in the Montville Township home and list his home address in Goshen. Jessica said she did live in the home where the animals were taken, but she told me there's a different side of the story as far as condition. Ackerberger also faces an obstruction of justice charge that Levy does not. Police have not released details, though, as to why the two are scheduled to be in court again next week. At the live desk, Zach Crenshaw, WSBT 22 News.